Playing in the orchestra made me an incredible athlete because I had to carry that cello every day, walking home to my house and back, because if I did not bring my cello home, the teacher knew that I didn't do my homework, I didn't practice my cello. And it's prepared me quite well for being a bobsled athlete where I have to lug all of our tools and equipment. So it was a good workout back in the day. My name is Lolo Jones. I'm a bobsled athlete in track and field, and I'm from Des Moines, Iowa. So being one of the oldest athletes on the team, we are gonna be here all day, I'm so sorry. Uh, I had a right torn labrum from hurdling. I tore my labrum. Then I returned to bobsled and I tore my left hip labrum. I've torn my hamstring so many times I can't even remember at this point. Concussions from bobsled, crashes, also whiplash really bad. Achilles is starting to go bad on me. Stitches in my hand from a bobsled, smashing into it. There's really no advantages to being old. <laughs> Lolo Jones making her first world championship stop. The Olympics is usually a young person's sport. I want to be there for the older people. You know, like we can do gnarly things as we compete and my mentality is super strong. Whether my body has these aches and pains, I am definitely very mentally tough, and I'm gonna bring that to my game every day. She has the lead. If we're talking about physicality, you can lose your speed as you get older, but you actually get really, really strong. And so I'm looking forward to using those strengths. Katie Humphreys and Lolo Jones, the world champions.